All right, so gentlemen, in here, looking at this vertical knockout drum, and I need the UT technician to do a little UT here where the inlet nozzle is, between the inlet nozzle and the outlet nozzle over there. I'm gonna go ahead and lay out a grid, that way the UT technician can do a little scanning here. Lay out a grid. I'm just gonna do a square grid right here. Get a representative sample of this head on the top of this vessel. Okay, so I've got more of it laid out. You see that I've laid out 12 stripes going from the center nozzle, the outlet, down towards the west to the inlet nozzle. Now what I'll do is I'll go ahead and segment the other direction so that I've got 12 squares by 12 squares, 144. Okay guys, I've got it all laid out now, both directions. So I've got a grid, 12 lines one direction, and then I did the alphabet the other direction. You'll know that I have noticed I have skipped the vowels except A. E and F look the same, I looks like a number one, and the O looks like a zero, so I don't use any of those. Say it's a grid. It's on the head, so it goes from almost the middle of the vessel down to the girth seam of the head. So then I'll just have the UT technician UT it. That's the top of that. Figured I'd show you what the thing looks like. The inlet is over here, and of course the outlet is right at the very top. There's some baffles, all that other stuff. Not a very big vessel, of course, but we'll uh, do a little bit of UT to see if there's any corrosion. 